Hello everyone, Carlos here from Everything Tech and a couple of videos back I reviewed, um, well I did some benchmarking tests on uh, the SK Hynix 256GB uh, SSD and this is just an updated video to let you guys know uh, to be very careful when buying the drive um, well I bought mine from Amazon and here is the box for it and um, after testing it, during the video that I was benchmarking the drive, I explained that um, I had some smart errors on the drive and it was a bit worrying, but um, I couldn't find any smart errors in the software in Windows, but I did find them in OS X. Well, that changed because I investigated a little bit more and I found out that it, it indeed gives you... Um, uh, the software in Windows HD Tune, um, it does show the errors, but it doesn't classify the, them as um, fatal, uh, which is different from the OS X uh, Smart Utility, uh, where it classifies them, uh, classifies the drive as failing. Um, so I got back in touch with Amazon, and um, they sent me a replacement one. And guess what? Exactly the same no difference whatsoever. Now the most worrying part about this is not that it's got uh, some errors when you first connect it and it doesn't happen again. Now they, it starts with uh, 1,156 errors and one day later there was already uh, 1,293 errors. So every time you use the drive it will give you more and more errors. It complains about the MI, which normally is the cable. I've swapped many cables and uh, the issue still persists. And the same cable uh, plugged into my Toshiba or to my Samsung Evo produces no errors whatsoever. It's just perfect. Now, um, I sent one back and I sent, I'm sending the second one back, which is this one, which was the first one that they sent me, which I cloned my OS onto. Um, I've ordered the Samsung um, Evo and I will be putting the unboxing and benchmarks in Windows and OS X um, in today so watch out for that there are some screenshots of the errors that I that I got I can post them it should appear around here and um, also I filmed some stuff which you can see now and these are all the errors that I get and it's a little bit worrying I don't get them with my Toshiba like I said and uh, Amazon removed the product from uh, the store you can still buy it on uh, uh, other buyers third-party buyers but you can't order it on Prime until they investigate the issue uh, so there you go quick update uh, watch out for the Samsung uh, 840 EVO 256 gigabyte or 250 gigabyte uh, SSD video which is coming in tonight. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.